It's day six, and I'm at my nan's, which is why I've got these lovely curtains. <laughs> um, today is the first bad day that I've had all week since I started this video. Um, I guess it was sort of like quite naive of me to think that it would just be plain sailing, and I wouldn't feel like crap. It's just a bit um, disheartening because it's a new protocol and uh, what happens for anybody that doesn't know like when you wake up and it's a bad day or a good day you'll hear a lot of people talk about bad days and good days with things like bipolar and ME and um, I wake up and it feels like I haven't slept for about a month and it feels like I just feel like an overwhelming sense of dread <laughs> which just lasts all day and um, my mind starts sort of shutting down a bit and uh, like, to tell the truth I really didn't want to make a video um, ah, I really didn't want to make a video because I like the world to see the best part of me um, like when I was when I started making this documentary, I was like documentary video diary, whatever. I was like, yeah, you can do this, man. You can just it'll be fine. Uh, but I was in a good frame of mind then, and I'm in a bad frame of mind now. But I promised myself that I was just going to carry on and do it so that people can see. So like days like today, I just I'll probably be just be in bed all day. Um, watching comedies, trying to make myself happy, trying to make myself feel okay and back on track again. Uh, yeah, but yeah. So this is day day six. It's, it's day seven. Um, I haven't left my bed since yesterday, apart from to get drinks or to go to the toilet. Um, I promised myself over this whole thing, though. That I was just going to try and do mind over matter and just stay as positive as possible so that's what I'm doing um, on days like today I sort of it's just like everything feels so like weak and tired and like everything looks really bright and the annoying thing is, is I can't pinpoint it down to something like I suppose it's when I started like adding the soups back in I started feeling really bad which doesn't make sense because all I've been eating is courgettes, leeks and chickens and stuff that I wouldn't normally react to anyway. And I don't know. It's weird. It's annoying that I've got to go through this process alone as well. That like, there's no doctors. Like for over the past five years, I've probably done like you name it. Like I've tried it to try and get better. Like acupuncture. Uh, like therapy, CBT, uh, graded exercise therapy, rest therapy, like pff, like a million supplements, and, and I've always got to like I always pin so much hope on all these things, and then like it's like five years, and then you just come back to the point of just feeling you wake up and your whole body just feels like it wants to shut down. Anyway, this is this isn't positive thinking, is it? This is just me moaning. Uh, so it's day seven. So it's been a week. Um, part of me just like because I've lost half a stone. I weighed myself this morning, so I'm underweight quite a bit. Uh, moaning, stop it! <laughs> well, the life is good, and I will get better. Anyway, it's the end of day seven. <laughs> 